<laughs> back to jail, bing, bang, boom. Yeah, baby, we're starting the podcast right now. We're back. You know what, dude? Live. Welcome, everybody, to the show. YKW. I started the social media podcast. The back. The YKW dude podcast. YKWD's back again. Old school, back in the day, where it all started. Before them all, YKWD. This podcast is so fun and crazy. It has no rules. Shut up! You're ruining this. Where's the ball, man? Sorry, it's a comedy podcast. This isn't NPR. That's what this podcast does. Is there any better show? This is the original. Original. What are you doing, Keith? What are you doing? Why is your fucking mug in the camera? I'm wearing. I'm not in the camera. I'm back. <laughs> Why, when we came up, you like this? What are you? Leave him alone. He's exhausted. I'm exhausted. I'm fucking, you know. He thinks he's got prostate cancer. I got up and see. Every time. I'm tired of it. Uh, I speak of Keith. No, you speak Keith. What did he, he just say? Because I don't he understand. Said he's exhausted because he has to get up all the time at night to pee. Right. Well, stop drinking wine like it's fucking uh, water. Drinking water, idiot. All through the night, I got water. <laughs> I'm throat nice and clear. That's what they say from COVID. How? Away from COVID. How yeah. are you? How are you? Six months into this fucking thing, and you still sound like shit. And you fucking look like crap. What is going? Do you want me to come to your house and set something up for you? No, he doesn't want to do this. But what? <laughs> you need to set up. You want to set something up to do your podcast? No, but don't you do? Don't <laughs> you do other? <laughs> yapping. But we Everybody we can't. Yapping. It's too much yapping. We need silence. Let's just sit here in silence for an hour. That's back in the day. That's what everybody would say. Let the women yap. Let Gabby run a gab. But I'm tired of yapping. Oh my God. (laughs) Sorry, but I'm really. Oh. Gabby. What? 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 That's yapping. Gabby and a bunch of women. Men are not supposed to yap that much. <laughs> Did you just say women aren't supposed to yap that much? No, he You're says on women. A podcast with three women. I, well, it, so what? I'll tell them now. Women are only supposed to yap. Men are not supposed to yap that much. So women are supposed to. Yeah. When I was in the house with my mom and all, I go to the table with them and I try to get on on and gossip. I said, "Oh, what else happened?" And my mom would smack me from the table, like "Shut up and stop being a woman." And I'm like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> then I learned that men aren't supposed to talk that much. Keith just wants and to know I'm the gossip. What? I wish I could slap you in the mouth right now. <laughs> 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 I fucking love Keith. I would listen to him just yell at me every day. Come on, it's not do that, Mike. Now you know, Mike. There's something to it. Man, listen, I'm I, too much right. I yap for a living, so I have no choice. I can't stop once you've released the crack, and I can't stop fucking talking. <laughs> Look, I, I understand that, but I'm talking about on social media. All has too many men yapping. Every time yep. he's telling me, arguing, yapping, this and that, I'm 
sick of it. I agree. Cloud chasing okay. motherfuckers. Okay, I agree. Okay, well, I. <laughs> this I'm is just some saying, of the worst connection we've ever had. It, I mean, you, your iPad is so far away from you. Half of your head is out of the fucking shot. I mean, my head is shot. You're off. <laughs> Who? But who backlight? Who backlight? Now, why, did he tell me, why did he tell me to make my shit go? I always had it perfectly when I had it the way I wanted to have it. Then fucking that little Mexican fucking start yapping from the heavens. Hey, put your mic front up there. <laughs> Fuck that, man. I'm sick of it. <laughs> yeah, I'm up in heaven with Black Panther. He says he doesn't like you. Oh, my oh. God. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> Hey, I guess Wakanda for well, not anymore. <laughs> I, so, Keith, Mike, let me tell you something about last night. I'm Please. glad. That, first of all, this is what you have to deal with now with Keith. He's officially a grumpy old man. Okay, just a grumpy old man. You never. We used to walk in the cellar, Calta. Hey, yeah. what's up, player? What's up? What's up, young buck? Hey, woo, hey, and. You walk in now, he just stares at you. Like my grandfather, the last year of his life. <laughs> and he, and, and he, and that, but I'll tell you what, he still lies. Yesterday, we he calls me up. We talk. We're going to this gig. We're going to the, uh, exactly, curmudgeon. That's what you are. Curmudgeon. You're a curmudgeon. Not a curmudgeon. So we go to this gig. We did the uh, Colin Quinn Put this show together on HBO Max. Me, Keith, Rachel, Voss, Bonnie, Dan Soder, Chrissy a good Lee, Sam J, and Marina. With and and basically, you show up and this camera's rolling. They got all the backstage smashings and fu- I mean, they a lot of it was just us being us backstage, fucking being awful. I mean, the amount of fat jokes that I got. <laughs> <laughs> I had to go to a meeting last night when I got home at one in the morning. Oh. I had to find some type of help. Okay. When and then I got me. <laughs> <laughs> he just does another fat joke. It's just me. You say a fat guy meeting. <laughs> Can you just hold your iPad near you? And I thought you said you were eating. Talk close to the iPad. You're too far away. Uh, fuck this. You know, you're on an iPad first generation. Uh, all right. So, anyways. So then, that's fine. Do it that way. So, anyways, it's at a drive-in in Brooklyn on the water. The Hudson. The backdrop. The backdrop is the fucking. <laughs> the backdrop is the fucking skyline of Manhattan. Right. And. They bring in, I think, 50 or 60 cars. There's a stage. Voss is hosting. We all go up and, you know, we're smashing each other. Then you go up and do time. Smash, you know, so they get in the back, the backstage the whole time. So while you're on stage, they're literally recording uh, people just trashing you. While you, there was no, there was no positivity. <laughs> right out of the gate, Keith goes, uh, all right, who's going to bomb? And Colin was like, let's take bets. So we took bets, cash money. Voss lost on the bombing, by the way. Who bombed first? Well, Voss was hosting, okay? But Voss always finds a way, I don't know how he does it, to pull it out. You know what I mean? He wound up doing crowd work with cars. I don't know how he did it. So, and then you go on stage. What's that? Because if Voss was on fire the whole night, Voss, uh, he came Always. lit. Yeah. Oh, he must have taken a nap. He had some vitamins. <laughs> he had blue <laughs> shoes matching his blue hat. <laughs> oh, and it was. The thing that pissed me off, he had a mask that matched shit, and it was too small. <laughs> yeah, his ears, his fucking ears were bent down. Like this. Right. It was infuriating, his dumb mask. Yeah. So that, I mean, he's, he's, He's tra- there's a doctor that's supposed to on camera give us this talk and tell us so you can kind well, of catch the moment of talk. He yeah, gave us serious, serious talk. talk up front. Like, hey man, right you up. gotta be careful. Corona, 
things are bad. Make sure you wear your mask. Do the da 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 da. But boss was yapping so much. Go ahead, Bob. He he literally was smashing the guy. <laughs> what did he say? Well, what what was the line? I don't. Everything. His hair, his clothes. And then Colin said, "All right, let's let's get to it. If if you could wish Corona on anybody, who would it be?" Doctor went pointed, that guy right there, right there, <laughs> that guy pointed right at us. No hesitation, uh, not even joking. A doctor went him right there. <laughs> no, that's great. But, it's incredible. Uh, it was it was an amazing show. Everybody did great. Some better than others. But listen, the thing is, no. Give me the run. Tell me who shit the bed. Yeah. I no, prayed God. that Chrissy D <gasps> fail last night. Well, you have a close connection to God. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you should you should pray for other things right now. <laughs> and let Bobby get his dream watch. Yes. Let Bob- <laughs> right? What? <laughs> Best friends. <laughs> and let Keith get a new microphone. Oh, uh, let Keith. I want something. Oh no. Oh, what do you Wait. What do you need, Gabby? What do you need? Say it. I want um a hot new. What? Oh yeah, I want a big honking pair of tits. Wish for it. You should wow. wish for a medium pair of tits. No, you get a big pair of tits, you'll you'll fall over. <laughs> um, you should wish for some tits. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, you should just wish for a bee to sting one of your tits. I <laughs> listen. So fucking this is this is the deal though. Keith, the night before. Ah, stupid. This this is how he this is how he talks to you, by the way. Ah, stupid. <laughs> I gotta explain to my son that stupid coming from Keith is a term of endearment. Because Max at after the barbecue was going, hey, stupid. No, 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 no. Not you. That's the way Keith talks. That's the way a, an old grumpy curmudgeon talks. Right. We should, we should, we should meet up at the uh we should meet at the cellar. We'll drive over in one car together. I was like, Yeah, no problem. I'll pick you up. So I'm driving in. There's some traffic. I'm gonna be, I call him 10 minutes late. Three, I'm gonna be there at 310. We're supposed to be at three. I show up, I pull up in the bike lane in front of the cellar. This cocksucker's got a champagne and ordered a hamburger. <laughs> and, I'll be right out. Like, I'm waiting for my cheeseburger. That's exactly what he said. <laughs> so I'm like, we got to go. He's like, ah, pull up. Come on over. Come on over. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm fighting with five in, five Indian traffic cops keep coming up to me. You got to go. You're on bike lane. You got to go. I'm like, I, I'm wait, I keep going. My friend, he's handicapped. I'm just waiting for him to come. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Don't call me. I'm handy, capable. Oh my God! So oh, anyway, I learned that in of life. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, he finally gets it. I pull around the corner. He gets in the car at three fifty. Three fifty. No hamburger. All right. I go, where's the dumb hamburger? He goes, ah, fuck it. It ain't, they, it ain't coming. So we waited for nothing. <laughs> I, I don't believe that. I believe he ate the hamburger. So then I go, I go on Waze, Google, I go on Waze and Google, I type in the address, it tells me to go a certain way. The whole time, stupid, take a right. You're going the wrong way, dummy. I've been going here for 50, 50 years. I've been going stupid. I would, I would give anything for Keith to be my fucking GPS voice. <laughs> Read it up, you late motherfucker. You're fucking late for everything, you dumb bastard. <laughs> you went the wrong way again, stupid. Just <laughs> at home eating all them fucking chips, you fat fuck. Take a left right here, jackass. <laughs> <laughs> Your mother's fat. Stop. You're over. Arri- you arrived, dude. The whole way, he's fucking any traffic we hit. He's going. See, look at this shit now. God damn. I just waited fifty minutes for this fuck. <laughs> we we literally made it to Brooklyn in twenty five minutes. It's, I mean. Zoomed, fucking zoom there. <laughs> then we pull into the lot, and I'm like, "Do we go here? Just pull in, stupid!" So he panics me. You get so nervous because I had a bad, you know, stepfather that you. So he reminds me of Billy. I, I'm like, oh, "Okay," and I I park the car, and then I find I find out that we could park right at the gig. So he's like, "Ah, dummy, you should have parked over here." I'm like, 
<laughs> I, I would watch a show with just the two of you driving for an hour in rush hour traffic every day. Oh. And the show will be called Comedian. Eh, and uh, just the noises that they make. Ah, and eh. it's it's literally like driving <laughs> with a, 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 a guy, an old guy back in like the, the 50s. Every girl you drive by, look at that. It's like, relax. <laughs> relax. Look well, at, look at 50s, that. 50s, you wouldn't be sitting so close to each other. <laughs> I wouldn't be driving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then, we, then we get there. We're literally pulling up, and I'm, we're walking up, and he's yelling at me. He's, this camera's going. They have cameras going. He's yelling at me. And I, I, I don't really, I see the cameras at the last second, but I, I go, hurry up. <laughs> and then I turn, I see the cameras. I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> they got me yelling. They got me yelling at an old guy who had a stroke who's walking down the street. And I go, hurry up. He's like, I'm coming, stupid. It is fucking infuriating. Uh, how was the show, though? Did you feel good? show was good. Yeah. show was good. Yeah, the show was great. I I was a little nervous going up last. Just you know, right. going no, up no, last. No, 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 no. You don't get to say you want last. You don't get to say you want last. Colin well, Quinn want last. I'm saying comedy wise. You were headlining. <laughs> I'm saying from for the people there. Right. I, I technically wasn't last, but I was last. The show. Sure. sure. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha. When will we? When will we get to see this? I don't know. Where? Dude, we know where. I, uh, HBO Max. It's oh, gonna be really? on HBO Max. I gotta the order girl... a new fucking HBO to watch this. Yeah, I mean, I'll you give you my have password. To. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna bootleg it. It's uh, <laughs> the girl who who actually I was talking to Colin about it, and he explained to her, "Listen, yes, we can do a show. We, but he he was like, I want to get." real funny i want to get these guys off stage i want to people to experience what it's like before you see these specials and it's just give it up for this guy give it up for her and they you see them just killing doing this i want people to see what it's like to do one of these shows mm. they i want should, they should have started at in your house and you going to pick up keith and that whole fucking thing that would have been great well, I'm not driving to Woodbridge to go get fucking Keith. It's no, but bigger, I'm saying go in the car with you, drive to the cellar, and then wait for your fucking waiting for Keith. That would have been great. It would have been boring because it would have been me just relaxing. I had a couple nice conversations with good friends about nice things, and we I drove in. It was a really peaceful, beautiful car ride into the city. <laughs> until I pulled up and saw fucking wine sipping, swirling asshole fucking just sitting there going come on get over here <laughs> yelling at me like an uber driver <laughs> uh, <laughs> anybody knows robert kelly no he's not calm and cool and collective if you ever drove with robert kelly he's yelling at people he's swerving in and out of traffic fuck you you're not <laughs> <laughs> listen you might have a point but the fact is okay <laughs> So then, so then we go back, we do the show. This is what a piece of shit Keith is. <laughs> shit. We're, we're literally, we're, we're, we're at the gig. We're a block away. I'm taking a right and then a left into the parking lot. Right. Rachel calls me. Hey, where are you guys? I go, what are you talking about? Keith said, you're going to pick me up. <laughs> Keith, I forgot. No, that's not. That's not what he does, Mike. He fucking double down and lies and says, "Ah, Bob, Bob wouldn't stop." <laughs> he blamed me. <laughs> uh, Bob hates Jews. <laughs> he, he fucking blamed me. I'm like. Rachel, but for some reason, people <laughs> believe Keith. He has some spell over people that I think that they think he's a, an honorable guy. I don't know what fucking magic <laughs> he has. You're not honor. 
I'm sitting there going, Rachel, he didn't tell me at all. And then we hang up with her and he goes, I go, why would you lie? Why would you just, we could have picked her up. He goes, ah, she's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, wait, it gets, <laughs> it gets worse. So we, after the show, he's You're like, let's fucking go. insane. She's I go, let's, stupid. <laughs> I go, let's go to the cellar and get some food, right? Because the cellar outside is open, right? <laughs> and he goes, all right, let's go. So we call Liz. I go, Liz, me, Keith wants a hamburger, of course, the one he never got. Uh, give me the salad and the wings, right? She's like, all right. And then Voss is like, can we get a uh, Caesar? Sa-? And uh, <laughs> fucking Liz goes, no, fuck them. I'm not. <laughs> Tell them they have to look at the menu. <laughs> so me and Keith get in the car. We drive to the cellar. I park the car the whole way. Ah, stupid. Park over here, dummy. Take it right here, stupid. Yeah, you can park <laughs> it. Dumb, dumb. I do it all the time. I mean, it's just a fucking smashing of, of your self-esteem. I'm 50. Oh. I, am a, I have a son and a wife. I own a house. <laughs> I, 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 and I am being yelled at. I feel like I'm just an abused kid that he adopted. Because he needed somebody to help him drive him around. <laughs> we get to the cellar. Our food's waiting. All of a sudden, Rachel pulls up in an Uber. She's like, what the fuck? What happened? I go, what are you talking about? Keith said I could come with you guys. Again? He goes, he did it again. <laughs> he, I go, Rachel, he never told me. He goes, ah, she never said that. She go. <laughs> Do her face. <laughs> wow. What is wrong with you? Answer. Rachel was drunk. Oh. She was very drunk last night. She had a lot to drink. And uh, you know, everything was everything was going good. She would make up stuff. Rachel would make up stuff and I I didn't remember it. Like she said, uh I told you something, and and she never told me. So she's a liar. Rachel is a liar. Oh and a jerk, God. evidently. <laughs> she's, she, but I don't listen. He's saying, uh, guys, I don't know what. See, do you understand what he's doing? I don't know what to believe. Right. It's I, hard. I, okay, so because I believe Rachel's a good person. I believe Keith is is Rachel inherently is not a good person. No, Rachel I I believe. A, can I, can I say this? Go ahead. Let me say yep. this. I need to say this. <clears throat> Rachel is a bad mother. She <laughs> got a newborn. She's a bad mother. I put it out there. <laughs> you are a sick human being. <laughs> what right. have to do? I'm a, no, I'm not a sick human being. <laughs> I'm a teller. He, he's a, he might be right. Is she breastfeeding? No. Dude, what, what does that have to do with this? all that alcohol in your system if you're breastfeeding. I, I just want you to get the overview of Rachel, who Rachel really is. Listen. That's what? what a horrible think, person. Listen, Michael. I think, Ray, this is it. I, I go on stage. I come off, I come off stage, right? Right. And look, I mean, Keith. I fucking killed, right? So I come off stage. I walk up to the group of comedians and Bonnie and Voss, and and they're all going, hey, what happened to the mic? I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, the mic, did the mic cut out? And I was like, no, no, I didn't. Uh, there was one horn that fucked up when I was, she goes, oh, we the mic, the whole thing cut out. We couldn't hear it. So I was like, I don't know. I walk away. Rachel, this is what a good person Rachel is. She comes up to me. She goes, Bobby. You did, you killed, you did so good. And it bugged everybody so much that they pretended to, that the mic cut out. Cause they didn't want you to, oh. they didn't want you to, feel, they didn't want you to feel good. So they, this is, this is, this For Keith me. Robinson, Bonnie McFarlane yeah, and Rich Voss. I enjoyed, I enjoyed every bit of it. That's <laughs> or gets off stage, he's going to think he killed. And you know, he's going to come walking and looking for some sort of appreciation. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> Fuck. Or was Rachel just so drunk she thought she heard your set? Rachel. 
<laughs> Rachel, <laughs> Rachel, Rachel walks up, Bobby. I can't, I can't do it. I, you, you did great. They just were trying to be mean to you, and I, I can't do it to you. That's what type of person Rachel is. What a jerk. <laughs> so, so then we go to the cellar. Yeah, Rachel's a neat- <laughs> she cock blocked the joke. Yeah, we having fun, and she's gonna get in there. No, Bobby, you did great. <laughs> Plus, you didn't. You fucking as nice as she was. You didn't even give her a ride into the fucking cellar. Mike. Yeah. He never told me we were driving her in the cellar. She lives five minutes from the venue. I don't believe okay? anything she says now. <laughs> so, so we get to the cellar. Rachel pulls up, all fucking like. What? <laughs> now everybody understands what I said about Rachel. She she's a busybody. She interferes with fun, and we were having a good time smashing, saying that Robert Kelly, like, oh man, we didn't hear it. We what, what happened? Where were? And he he thought he killed. You can hear it in that. I killed. I killed. But he, he th- had that thing in his head that every comic has. Did I really kill? What, <laughs> what are they talking about? Listen, and we I'm just going to down in his head. Listen, I'm just I, look, I had the set of the night. I'm just going by what the producers said. That's all. Woo! Not what I said. Just what the producers said as I walked off and all the uh all the messages I got today. I mean, Lou was there last night. Lou, you can chime in if you like. But anyways, um so anyways, Who's, this is look, this is the this is what I'm happened. Little, this is what she knew who had the set of the night. I had the set of the night. Ah, eh, you were good, but you you were a little. Horns than everybody, I got. Yeah, but... so many, I, if you get a standing horn ovation, that's what I got. <laughs> I got a standing horn ovation. They love me. What is that like? Is everybody just lays on the horn? Is that a standing horn ovation? <laughs> oh, they were horning me up. To the Dude, fuck you. Calta, I got horns, windshield wipers, and oh, hazard. Oh my god! Whoa! Couple of couple of exhaust pumps. Yeah. <clears throat> no, I got some <laughs> emergency brakes. <laughs> some good <gear> shit. <laughs> couple of timing chains were loose. Dude, I got I got five interior lights. <laughs> interior lights. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Defrosters everywhere. <laughs> Holy shit. I got seven, so, I got seven high beams. <laughs> so anyways. Boy, so, let's ask let's ask the heart. Lou, don't fuck around. Be just be honest. Just write one thing, no other word. Tell us. Bobby. Did Bobby do better or did Keith do better? Just write Bobby or Keith, and that's it. Don't say anything else. Lewis dressing the fuck out right now. <laughs> Just put a B or a K or a D for Keith because he's a dick. He knows if she says Bobby, then Keith's going to turn on. I never fucking like Lou. <laughs> Always takes a good parking space. Oh, oh. oh. Lou. Fuck that. Fuck Easy that. Out. Come on, Lou. Come on, Lou. <laughs> so anyways, so th- it doesn't even end there. This is what shit friends we are. We're terrible people. So we go to the cellar. Rachel comes up. Then, of course, Voss comes up staring at your plate of food. And then his hand always, if there's French fries or potato chips, Voss's hand, like a crane game at Denny's, will just come in and grab them and take them out. Right. And so... Then uh, Voss, Bonnie, and they had Raina, the, the kid, right? And their kid is so mean. So Va- but there's not enough room, me and Voss. So they had to go sit over at this table because you can only do four at a time, four tops. So me and Keith were over here already eating. They went over there. Rachel sat with them. All of a sudden, Rachel comes over. She's almost in tears. She's like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> From the kid? Can- yeah, the kid, <laughs> Raina's vicious. That kid is like the fucking daughter from Beetlejuice. The Truly. Kid, the kid, That's she goes, <laughs> Raina, well, like, what's wrong? She's like, I don't know. Raina was just really mean to me. I don't know why. 
She asked me what my daughter's name on I said Frankie, and then she's like, Why Frankie? Why would you name a kid Frankie? That's like from the fucking 80s. Why would you? And then Rachel was like, I started explaining. Well, you know, because my grandmother. And then I'm like, what the fuck am I explaining this to an 11 year old? (laughs) She comes and sits with us because she can't handle an 11 year old. (laughs) They should have mic'd up the kid and never made all the comics cry. Everybody was scared. Everybody's scared of fucking the boss's kid. That's so funny. Oh, why God, why is so she so mean? Look at her fucking parents. Look at her home life is like. That kid's mean because every time she eats in the dining room, she's got to look at those ugly fucking paintings that Rich is so proud of. Oh, God. His fucking, his goddamn uh, a museum of fine art living room bugs yeah. the shit out of me. His yard sale fine art. Um, One of the paintings is worth like 40 grand, though. Did you know that? I don't believe that at all. I swear to God. Really? I, the, the guy... In his house, worth forty grand. Nothing in his house is worth forty grand. Nothing. He the might guy. have a pair of Jordans worth a grand. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> that bugged me too. Everybody had brand new Jordans on last night, except for me. I had Converse. It's good. Be yourself, Bobby. It's okay. It's okay. But, uh, what's up, dudes? Winning season returns at mybookie.com. That means doubling your first deposit. What? They're doubling it. It's time to celebrate the NFL season. Invest in your intuition. Use promo code YKWD and double your first deposit. New players get up to a thousand in free play. That's crazy. Designed to add more excitement to the sports you love and the games you bet on. Okay, it's simple. Make your picks. Boom. Win big. Bang. Collect your cash. Whap. Use promo code YKWD and double your first deposit. Your winning season begins today, right now, only at my bookie. Yeah, it was it was. And then Colin shows up at the uh, fucking cellar. So it was all of us out in front of the cellar. And then uh, what Sam Sam J came down. Sam J, boy, uh, Sam J was yelling at somebody about race stuff at another table, and uh, I, I fucked up a little bit. Therapy, my therapy. And what is it? Stupid, Kelly, trying to have give nicknames. He says Sam, Sambo. I'm like Sambo. Yo, don't say Sambo. Oh, you mean true feelings, Bobby, was there? No. <laughs> Keith, Keith, Keith knows. I was just getting, yo, Bobo. Uh-huh. I was like, Bobby, yeah. Sam. She was like getting mad. And I was like, Sam, Sambo. And Keith was like, what, motherfucker? <laughs> it's a good thing his name wasn't Nick. <laughs> oh, my God. Ah, shit. It was fucking, I mean, last, I don't know what, I don't know how they're going to air this shit. It was so mean, so fucked up. It was such a fucking brutal, uh, all the stuff they got off camera was so brutal. I don't, I don't know how they're going to air that or how, I hope it's not too inside because people like fluffy shit, man. This is not going to be fluffy. I don't know. I think all the people that loved you know, uh, what do you call it? What was that show that you guys all did? The one where you fucking, the one that was on, T- on Comedy Central. The one that you guys all shit on each other. Yeah, we know. We're just making, well, why would you give it to him? Make him get it. What are we, what are we, his fucking Wikipedia, no. Keith? <laughs> Sorry, true, sure, true feelings, Bobby. Uh, <laughs> does that my, I got to that's my true feelings, Bobby. Hey, uh, boss. <laughs> It's so funny because Voss messed up Rachel's name. What'd he say? He fucking he said Fiddlestein or some shit. I don't know. I don't know. Voss is the worst intro ever. His his I've done the Tonight Show. We've all done great, amazing. We got amazing titles. We and Voss was like, ah, it's one of my favorites. I like this guy. That's not a credit. That's a that's a discredit, actually. <laughs> you don't need Voss's opinion on anything. 
Oh, my God. Lou said Sam J was the best last night. Oh, 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 there you go, Crumbum. Lou likes Sam J the best. It's not me or you, Keith. It's if if me and you had a baby, it'd be Sam J. And Lou liked Lou liked her the best. <laughs> All right. That's fair enough. I'll take it. I'll take Sam J. Sam J did fucking knock it out of the park. She killed it. But uh it was so funny. Last night was such a fucking there's no way that you can live a, a spiritual, healthy m- uh, meditation, uh, recovering life and be friends with the friends that I have. No, it's impossible. It's impossible because I, I don't care how many meetings I went to, how, how long I meditated, how, 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 how much I talked to people about life and sobriety and how good, how many books I read that day. As soon as I sit down next to Keith, Voss, Bonnie, Colin, Rachel, nor any of them, it's out the fucking window. <laughs> Your self-esteem's on the floor, and you're just fighting to survive. <laughs> yeah. Well, oh. It's, it's what you deserve. Lou said what? it's not. What? Lou said not Sam J. Lou, just tell us who it is. Keith or me. Just go. Don't go, don't even do it now. My self-esteem has already took a hit with Sam J. No more. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can you open up the, the blinds so we can see the uh, lady putting out our garbage? What? Behind you? <laughs> Buddy, you don't live in a, what is it? What is it? The, the second floor of a fucking uh, a condominium <laughs> all right, is not a penthouse. <laughs> You can see skyscrapers when I open Listen, my, door, my you, window. I guarantee you're in a nursing home right now. I, <laughs> I, I guarantee you have one that. recliner, a lamp, and a TV. That's it. Where's it's um, phone? I don't know. We we're can looking for it now? too. Yeah, we can hear you better. Yes. Yeah, there you go. How you doing, Gabby? Gabby, Gabby, what's up? <laughs> Keith, Keith loves me. Gabbo. Hey, Keith. Come on, Lou. Who was better? Come on, Lou. Lou, who Lou. was it? Hey, Keith. Lou, it's Lou. so funny that you finally Keith fucking meds put just your phone up. Fucking forty minutes into the show, you finally get your shit ready. Yeah, I'm ready to go now. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's start. I'm surprised that I haven't had a party started right. <laughs> yep. He yep. just ate an edible and it hit mid show. I want to, uh, I, I, last time Keith was on the show, I got in a, I got in a big fucking Lou. Come on, just say it, just do it so we can move on. Let's go. It doesn't matter. Keith's not going to care. No, it really don't matter. I mean, we love each other. Everything is good. Yeah. Me and Keith, I mean, look, good, but I mean, Nothing will hey, hurt my feelings. Go Lou, ahead. if you want to text it to me, I'll tell them. Yeah, Lou, just let Lou just. <laughs> you, you evil bastard. He's like, <laughs> I'll break the news. <laughs> uh, Why is, uh, who was there? Yeah. Alexis was there? Alexia. Alexia? <laughs> Alexia? Oh. <laughs> Alexia. The fuck is that? I forgot about that. that that's who Keith calls. <laughs> Alexa. He calls her Alexia because everybody else has some fucking corny white woman that goes, hang on. Keith has a stripper from fucking uh, <laughs> Camden, New Jersey named Alexia. What's up, daddy? I've got two bullet wounds, but she'll get me a drink whenever I want it. Oh, you mean I love you, Lou. I love you more. You know that. Lou, I've always loved you. Lou, you I, know I love, I love you, you more. so much, Lou. Who, I'm who pretty came sure over- you know, I love you more than both of those guys. So just tell me who it was, and I'll be happy to break the news to them. Yes. <laughs> um, so anyways, we uh, last time Keith was on, I got in trouble because I called Martin Luther King fat. <laughs> <laughs> True feelings, Bobby. But you Mush, can you bring up... Right now, you, we don't need this. Listen, listen. 
Dr. King was fat. not fat. L- L- Mush, bring up the link. I- Look Everybody, since you said that, I really took a closer look. Dr. King, show me one in shape person in his family right here. Uh, Rosa Parks was bow legged. No. <laughs> <laughs> Look at everybody's chubby in his family. <laughs> yep. hero. Martin Luther King the third looks like Keith. Oh my God! All right, get it off, Mush. He looks like white Bobby, black Bobby. <laughs> he looks like Cleveland. <laughs> I know. Huh? <laughs> so, Doctor oh, King, Doctor King weighed like one seventy-five. How do you know yeah, that? I looked it up. <laughs> he had he had fat days. There were days. There were times where he was fatter than other. He did all that walking though, and he slimmed down. All his marches got the pounds off him. Yeah, but he, he, but no, he was in. He was. I guess he would have been fat. He was on the but, oppression diet. He would have been fat yeah. if if he didn't get assassinated. Assassinated. Yeah. He probably <laughs> right. was no. headed towards that. Right. But he wasn't fat. Right. Well, He's all like, right. Uh, One eighty. Something like That's that. Doctor King wasn't. He was chubby. Can we say chubby? He wasn't. Why didn't uh, uh, Mike pull up uh, the the you know the image of Doctor King? Right. He just pulled up the fat family. So you can see. Yeah, but that's the, like the clones. <laughs> so you just call. Pull up you just call Martin Luther King's family the clumps. <laughs> Are they? They are big. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Martin. Uh, gee, Ooh, see. Martin. Ooh, Martin. <laughs> Ooh, Martin. <laughs> Martin, be, Martin be marching again. Ooh, Ooh civil rights. Civil rights. <laughs> civil rights. <laughs> oh, that is, uh, that, shit. That is, eh, look at the one with the fist. He's a little chubby, dude. As he got older, he yeah. gained weight. Yeah, look at the one. Oh, look at the- Oh my god, he's a Young. little chubby. A little chubby. Fat isn't a word I would use to What's describe him. So Keith, last night, last night, did she text you, Lou? You got to do it. Let's go. Get it out. You uh, got to do it. Did not text. Oh me. shit. Oh wait. Hey. Hold on. Nope. Keith, last night, what do you think about the show? Do you think? I mean, do you like? Do you think it's gonna be a it's gonna be a hit? Oh shit! God damn it! No, well, he's back. He's not back. He froze again. My internet is shitty. We know it's from being so high in the penthouse. Right, you're in the clouds. Your attitude is shitty. Oh. <laughs> Gabby would have done well last night. Gabby, Keith, Gabby, Gabby would have done well last night because you couldn't hear the laughter. So, fuck she you! Would have, she would have been right oh. at home. <laughs> but I should have never Gabby. expected that to be a compliment. Gabby, <laughs> Keith needs to get some of that just for men mustache. Oh man, Keith, there you are. No one. Oh Jesus Christ! Uh, Don't you do you have internet? I've been. That's not my internet. That's your internet. Oh no! Everybody here on? is fucking. Gr- Were y'all on and uh, on together talking? Yeah, we. I said Gabby would have done great last night because you couldn't hear the laughter. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk about my uh, Gabby. Hey! <laughs> what? Keith's Your on Gabby. my side. My Keith's on my side. Uh, so, anyways, last night, that was the weird part about Sorry. being on the thing. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, <laughs> His iPad Matt is having Gabby a stroke. I got nothing from him. 
bad. Lou. <laughs> come on, Lou. I can't wait for this show to come out. I don't even know if we're all going to be talking. This show's still going to be on the air by then. Just let me know who is funnier. Just type K I, or B. I, no, I got to go, so it doesn't matter. Say what you want to say, Lou. No, but you have to say in front of Keith. You can't wait till Keith gets off and then say Bobby, because then I don't believe that. Bobby did do better. And I, I got more horns. I know for a fact I got more horns. Yeah, because you made it up the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> they were proud. Those were proud yeah. horns. That was that was like that was an accomplishment. They, you were getting accomplishment yeah. horns. <laughs> I know. I got, I got a lot of horn breaks, dude. I got fuck. I got horn breaks inside of my jokes. I, I fucked up one of my jokes. I was getting so many horns. <laughs> <laughs> dude, I had a boat. I had a boat I horn like go by. People came out of the car for me. They came out of the car. And it wow. wasn't even allowed out of the car. They came yeah, out of the they car try- and started walking. They, try- they were going to help you back down the stairs when you were done. <laughs> <laughs> How funny was it? Christy had to go first, up. though. Oh, he took a nice one. Right his <laughs> oh, she head. said it. She said you. What? She said you. No, she said F and then you. Uh, yeah, but that's oh, my that's nickname. Fine. Oh. Oh, the F was for Fatty. Hey, what Fatty the you? fuck? Fatty did you? you? Mike just did fat on fat crime. I don't like it. <laughs> this is the worst part about it. This is the worst part about last night. I, I literally stepped on the scale yesterday. Uh-huh. I was 290. Wow. So I went from... 335 to 290 pounds. I'm g- about to break to I'll be I'll see an eight on the scale too soon, right? So I, I I go in, I'm feeling good. As soon as I get there, it's non-stop fat jokes. And this is the worst part. At least Keith doesn't apologize when he does a nice fat joke. He just goes, ha ha ha, yeah, fat so right. <laughs> Bonnie and Voss will fucking do fat jokes and then go, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Just do the fucking joke. Stop making me f- feel like a fat person. Like, I, I don't give a shit. But it did hurt a little bit. I'll be honest with you. At the Towards the end, it did hurt a little bit. Well, you got, you got mad at yourself for eating too many french fries last night. Oh, that's not on the whole 30. First of all, you're a rat. You're a fucking rat. <laughs> you was you know that? on me all fucking show. <laughs> you're, he, uh, you're a fucking fries. You, he was figuring <laughs> Bob figured the French fries. <laughs> First of all, you can have French fries. Potatoes are on the whole 30. Not not two orders. Nah. <laughs> Are they crinkly or straight? No, they're, they're straight. all kind. No, no, they had fat ones. <laughs> they had thin ones. Bob had like three baskets of fries. <laughs> You're never going to see an eight that way. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, you know what? You're a piece he was... <laughs> Dipping them in mayonnaise. <laughs> Ew! What are you That's on the whole thirty. <laughs> you're a piece of you. That's so European. You're a fucking snitch, bitch. I'm fucking. I'm gonna. You know what? You snitching bitch. First of all, snitchy bitch. I'm never eating with you again if you because I know you'll rat me out. You little snitch, bitch. Mayonnaise is on the whole thirty. You can't have ketchup. You can have mayonnaise. <laughs> You're a little fucking bitch. You know that? You're not from the streets of Philly. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I am. I only snitch on fat white guys. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, fucking Christ. What a piece of shit. Ah, fucking asshole. Uh, 
really just an asshole. I spent all weekend with him too at the fucking picket. We went to the we went to the stand together. This is Keith. Yeah, the stand. This is Keith. Yeah, the stand was fucking fun now. Yeah, it was fun. <laughs> but I I was zero for seven there, and finally broke through. Yeah, he did I with, so with me. Shows. Yeah, you did. Yeah, at the stand, I was just bombing and bombing and bombing. Because I got no, to get used to the outside crowd. Yeah, it's it's weird, right? Because you're out. Uh, so it was yeah. me, it was Keith, then me, Voss, and then Bonnie. And we all go up, and then Bonnie's up. We're across the street uh, by the bikes. And Keith goes, eh, how much Bonnie's going to take a hot one in front of this sidewalk <laughs> crowd? <laughs> <laughs> He's the meanest fucking person ever. And poor Voss, poor, poor Voss, poor Voss is like, what? 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 <laughs> and Keith is just going out. Ah, is the first one that stunk. <laughs> we're, we're laughing so hard across the street. Poor Voss had to walk away because she's looking right at us. Oh, wow! <laughs> oh, fucking Christ! Just ruthless, ruthless fucking cocksuckers. We all are. It's a terrible, terrible group of people. People don't like us. I've been in AA meetings where, like, comic AA meetings, and other comics from the West Coast literally talk about like, "Oh, you East Coast comics are mean," and it's because of that man you're looking at right now. <laughs> Uh, I'm a very nice guy. I'm a very nice person, and I'm loving, loving and caring. I feel it. Not, I forget Colin Quinn. I gotta call Colin. Colin called. Colin said what you were last night, and it was exactly true. I'm calling him right now. He fucking pinpointed you. He said, "You know what Keith is?" And I said, "What?" And he goes, "This." And I went, "Oh." My God, that's exactly what you are. And you used to do it with Patrice, and now you do it with me and everybody else. And then you sit back in the cut and you watch the fuck everybody just tear the room down and fucking are mean to each other. And it's because of you. Because one, ah, oh, yeah, fuck, he's not answering. He, this is what Keith does. We'll all be sitting there, and then Keith will go, eh, look at this fucking, look at this. Fuck. And you'll be like, yeah, yeah. And then you start going at it. And you start tearing that person, and then other people join in, and then I'll they'll start fighting with me, and someone starts trash, and then we're all trash, and he's sitting there like this, just sipping his wine, going, an instigator? instigator. Yeah, but it's worse than that. It's it's worse than that. He's that's not he, 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 I just want to I want to see camaraderie between friends. That's all. I want to see everybody get together and have fun. <laughs> Lou, we got six minutes, Lou. Six minutes. Six minutes, and we got to go. <laughs> and we fucking just know. Talents. <laughs> I'm so glad Chrissy D took a shit. Come on, Lou. Uh, but no, listen, I, I love Lou, and she knows that. So whatever. Whatever it is, it is, Lou. I always love you. Uh, it's whatever. It doesn't matter, Lou. Come on, Lou. <laughs> Gabby, if you was there... You'd have seen Bob die. <laughs> he struggled. For, he Bob die. struggled. I'm be honest now. No, <laughs> I, I'm I'm be honest with you. Bob struggled for four minutes straight, and then he pulled it out at the rest of the three minutes or three minutes. You're out of your fucking. Listen to me. You are a fucking delusional. Out. You're a drunk. You know what you are. <laughs> You're a fucking whino. That's who you are. <laughs> you are a wino. You know that? You're a fucking out. You're literally just a drunk. Let's think about the I things we learned on today's show. Rachel Feinstein's an evil person. She's a bad mother. Bam! Look. Um, last night, Bobby. Keith today. Bullshit! No, you're not, you're not going to do that. <laughs> Woo! Not going to do that. The truth comes out. Lou, <sighs> I had... That's racially motivated. 
They were putting their front and rear windshield wipers on for me. <laughs> oh, yeah, you know, oh, he called this is what he called you. This is what this is what Colin called you. And this is exactly what fucking Keith is. This is Keith to, I mean, no fat on it, right to the point, the essence of Keith's fucking character and who he is. I'm gonna read it to you. This is exactly master of chaos. Oh, chaos. What the fuck is going on? (laughs) (laughs) That's exactly what you are. That's chaos. He loves chaos. He does not want to sit there and have a pleasant conversation. He doesn't like pleasantries. He doesn't like people talking about normal things or being happy. He wants fucking chaos. As soon as I said last night, Sambo, he went as loud as he could in front of, there was Black Lives Matter people walking by and Tifa people. What? What? What did you said? Sambo? Are you what the fuck? Screamed it. Screamed it. You did. He well, went, you did say Sambo. I was, I was, but you know exactly what I was doing. I was going, yo, Babo, Sambo, Sambo, Sam, Sammy. But it sounded different than when you said Sambo. Yeah, because I have a, I have a Boston accent. Everything sounds racist with my accent. Then when you followed it up with get up here and dance, that was a little over the edge. I didn't. That's fucking bullshit. That is bullshit. You should have never done that. <laughs> but anyways, last night was fucking epic. Great show. Great. I mean, wait till you see the backdrop. The backdrop, they got a big, the big uh screen, the the drive-in with us on it. And then right to the left of it is the stage. And there's nothing behind us except Manhattan skyline. Fucking That's crazy. Cool. It was pretty pretty fucking crazy um so but like i said before i don't know how they're gonna get the laughs i think they mic the cars i guarantee i hope colin gets people going uh uh he was good but bobby was the best i hope they get that in the car (laughs) now here's what you're gonna see here's what you're gonna see since i just found out my good friend lou is racist here's (laughs) what you're gonna see you're going to see on HBO Max when it airs the true thing. You'll see exactly what it is. And I, I want to come back right after the airing of HBO Max, right after it goes on air, and then we'll talk about it. And you'll find right. out how Lou really is. Racist. I know Lou. Lou is, Lou is not racist. Damn. Lou is the most loving person, Lou is most racist. supporting. No. <laughs> See what he does? Master of chaos. Of chaos. Yeah, and now he had Lewis racism. What about Rachel Feinstein? I don't remember. What's she's a bad mom? <laughs> she's I know. a bad mom. Rachel. <laughs> Who says that? She's a saying. jerk and a bad mom and a known liar. <laughs> Who says that? I don't know. Uh, the master of chaos says that with no apologies. Uh, <laughs> Lou, Lou said, look what Lou said. Mush, bring it up. The last thing. Oh. <laughs> oh well. All right. Oh, well. Yeah. Yeah. I like you're gonna that. take a hand you're gonna take a handy job. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna have a fucking most evil laugh. Ever. It's evil, scary. <laughs> what are you scared uh, for, Gabby? That yeah, creepy Gabby little psycho laugh you, you just did. <laughs> Gabby, if you Gabby. had to pick sweet love to Bobby or Keith, who would you pick? I had to. Yeah. Clearly, there's no want desire. You. Who? Uh, Calta. <laughs> oh, I was. No, not, I, said, I, said, I said between Bobby and Keith. No, I know, and I answered Calta. Oh, you know that's not part of the rules. That means nobody. You can't okay. do it. You can't do it. Say it. I'm sick of this uh, uh, 
allegiance to Bob Kelly. Fuck that. Say who you want. You want I can't. <laughs> it it has you to be Keith because I can't fuck Bobby. <laughs> Mal, enjoy your turned out vagina from that big boy. <laughs> you think your you think your Jersey Gap is big now? You'd be able to see the moon through your legs yeah. after you fucking hang out yeah, with that big boy. Gabby, yeah. <laughs> fucking gross to the both yeah. of you. Yeah. You'd have to <laughs> and you have to feed him jello as soon as he's done to get his blood sugar back up. <laughs> you know what? Holy shit. <laughs> you you're gonna go from a womp to a gap. <laughs> 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 what? What? <laughs> He's a fucking what? asshole. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ah, god damn it. Oh, Keith, you fucking you are a master of chaos, my friend. Not a master of chaos. Fuck that, man. Take it back. Tell Colin to take it back. I'm hurt. <laughs> no. No, you're a, it's exactly what you are. You never want anybody to, I'm telling you, I've been going to the table for years. I remember we'd sit there and Patrice would be there. All of us would be there and it'd just be a quiet night at the table. And Keith would lean into Patrice and go, eh, look at Bob's dumb shoes. <laughs> and then, and then just, just planting and a seed and then, and then just sit back like this <laughs> <laughs> with the glass. And then, and then, yeah, he'd just be like this. Look, look, look at Norton's, look at Norton's dumb chin. And then Keith would be like, "Eh, hey, Norton, look at your face." And Keith would just sit back. <laughs> the master. He is the master of the chaos. Puppet master. I want. I'm serious. If you ever hang I out at this, if you're ever with us, and Keith is there, just wait. It's gonna happen. First of all, he's gonna he's gonna do this a lot. What is that? He, gets tired. he falls asleep. He's he's on the verge well, of sleep. I got a heroin addiction. Oh. Yeah, we almost saw we almost saw a nipple on that. You weren't prepared for it. What is that yeah. dog? You mean you mean chest? What? <laughs> we almost saw a nipple when you were taking that off. <laughs> no, you didn't. I'm wearing a full full length tank top. Try it again. Gabby, stop teasing this old black man. Okay. <laughs> oh. I gotta say it. I, can I just? I want. I, <laughs> Keith, Keith, I don't like what? Rachel Feinstein. To me, is one of probably out of the group of all of us, one of the nicest people ever. <laughs> now I want to say something, Mike. At my barbecue, we're having a barbecue. She's there with her husband and her baby. Her husband is a firefighter for New York City. Her, the baby's just born. We're all having a good time. My kid's there. And Keith goes, Rachel's Rachel's a bad mother. <laughs> in yeah. front of everybody. Why? In front, of, do? in front of her husband. <laughs> He's not, he knows. <laughs> he gave me a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> in front of in front of the child, Mike. <laughs> My, my kid came up to me and goes, why is she a bad mom? I'm like, she's not a bad mom, Max. She's a great mom. That's it's just... No, Rachel, I, I, here it is. Let me, let me stop. Rachel is a great mother. But what's yep. better? To say she's a great mom or a bad mom? I mean, what's funnier? Funnier is a bad mom. <laughs> yeah, of course. I, yes, yes. Fun, right. Funnier, funnier is, is, yes, it's funnier, but it's still to the limit. I mean, it's to the end. There's no new, there's no, you go right to the end and you're, you, 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 you hurt Rachel's feelings and you lie to her and you make her look like she's a, a bad person. She's not. You know why? Because he's not the novice of chaos. He's the master of chaos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a perfectly good barbecue on a beautiful day. Everybody having a good time in the fucking 350 pool. We're having ribs. We're doing a nice. And then there goes Keith. Rachel comes up. Ah, she's a bad mother. While she, <laughs> while, 
Can I just say the baby was in her hands? <laughs> the baby was in her fucking hands. The who who would listen? I, look, I've been I've said mean stuff. Mike, we're all mean. You're mean. We're all mean. Gabby, M- Mush, we all say mean stuff. Not in a million years when I saw Rachel show up with her baby and the husband did my brain, my comic brain go, ah, I'm going to tell her she stinks as a mom. <laughs> you're, not, you're not the master. But here's what he did. As soon as he did it, we all laughed because, of course, it's funny. And then we started smashing Rachel because he knows how to get comics going. And we all started <laughs> smashing Rachel on what a shitty mom she was. And this <laughs> Fucker just sat there and laughed, just fucking sipping on his wine, eating a rib, going ha ah, 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 ah. <laughs> evil. Yes, <laughs> just admit, Keith. Admit, I'm not evil, Gabby. Gabby. Keith, admit you're the master of chaos. I'm not. I'm not. I'm a good person. I, uh, you know. And I have a sincere heart, a very good heart. Now, I want to talk about, before I get out of here, can I talk about this? I want to talk about Voss's Sunday cookout that he's going to have. Ugh. Exactly. Now. (laughs) Is that rotten kid going to be there? Making everybody feel bad? (laughs) No, nobody's going because we don't want to take a smashing from an 11 year old. I don't want to be called fat from an 11. I don't want to be like, you're going to eat more of that. I don't want that. I want to, I don't, I'm not, I can't go. Get ribs and she sits you down, opens up an encyclopedia to arterial sclerosis and starts telling you about what's going on. Fucking Beetlejuice kid. (laughs) Plus, plus Keith, plus the, Everybody's a fucking vegan or vegetarian at their house. Ugh. Uh oh. 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 <laughs> yeah. What kind of ball? I know her. She's a Honestly, bad mother. First of all, have, let me just start with this one question before we slowly take apart what a wild, hateful moron you are. Let's begin here. <laughs> Let's begin here. Have you ever changed a diaper in your dumb life? I'm sure you were at off-track betting when your kid was born, having yourself a fat cigar. I, that's what Keith did when his baby was born. He gifted himself with a nice trip to OTB. Oh, wife's in labor. Time to light up a fucking stick. <laughs> He's going to be changing his own diapers in a couple of years. Yeah. Robert yes. telling you, Forget- fucking snitch. You, if Keith if Keith did any of the things that his for his baby that his home attendant does for him on at a daily basis, <laughs> I bet you've never fed your baby soft carrots like your home attendant is about to feed you now because it's nap time and you have to leave and they kept you on so that I can defend myself. Keith really believes women aren't supposed to be outside working. He thinks that makes them a bad mother. Did you go out and earn your daughter a couple bucks? Yes, I did. And right after I left the babysitter and said, oh, my friend will pick me up, I came outside. And guess what? I don't have a friend. I have a misogynist pig that was on him, saw his sweet way to perform. Didn't give a shit. Stand new mother, too. New mother. Oh, my night out. Guess who's not there? My good friend, Keith. For a small drive, about two minutes away. Everybody's on set. I'm standing there holding my stupid change of clothes. And this dick left me high and fucking dry. <laughs> twice. He did it twice. Twice. But you know what? I, I mean, I am the dumb one in the end for believing that he has an ounce of integrity. He goes, ah, sorry, man. I, I got you. We're going to get you on the other end. I got you. Don't worry. Don't worry, stupid. We'll take you to the next place. And yes, there I was again. My stupid bag of clothes waiting. <laughs> All the snacks I packed in my big heavy set bag. Oh, and Keith and Bobby should be pulling around any moment now. After all, they are my friends. <laughs> Who treated you worse, Keith or or Voss's kid? Uh, I probably would have to say, you know what, Keith. At the end of the day, Keith. I mean, Raina. Listen, Raina hurt my feelings. I'm not gonna lie. It hurt. <laughs> I, I got a little defensive about how I had to name my baby. She's like, yeah, the name Frankie Six. I started telling her the history of the name. I was like, no, but it was 
you know, my, my husband's, you know, his father was a firefighter. So we named after him and it's a Jewish custom to name after someone that's passed away. I'm like, why am I defending myself? <laughs> I, I started going, I was rambling aimlessly about the meaning of my child's name. We're all, listen, all I want is for rain and the light. I'm not going to lie. But she's a Keith, fucking, she's a villain, that kid. But let's circle back to Keith. Keith yes. is a terrible person. Like he really is. And I do believe, I'll give you this. I believe Keith didn't tell Bobby because Bobby actually has a heart and Bobby probably would have picked me up. Absolutely. But Keith was like, I mean, pure joy when he was thinking of me standing outside with my stupid bag, waiting, yep. just waiting. Where are my friends? I have friends. They should Both be here times. soon. Both times. Yeah. He, he literally, when you hung up the phone with him, I go, why wouldn't you tell me that we had to pick her up? He goes, ah, she's dumb. <laughs> she's dumb. <laughs> Uh, no, he said she's a jerk. <laughs> oh, that's it. Sorry, that she's a jerk. <laughs> By the way, and Keith will trap me into saying I was a bad, bad mom. By the way, about a week after I gave birth, I see Bobby and Keith. Bobby's like, "Oh, you look great! I can't believe have you been working out, Keith." Eh, I think your arms look kind of fat. Eh, you got some, you got some arms, lamb. I'm like, what? I've been doing curls just thinking about his dumb fucking comments now. That's the thing. Is this ignorant moron makes me work a little harder with my dumbbells at home. Uh, I'm not going to be calls me a bad name. mother when I'm out, A, doing my job. I'll have, first of all, Keith is a wino, all right? He gets drunk on wine and falls asleep. He shouldn't even be drinking wine post-stroke, all right? He shouldn't, he shouldn't be drinking anything that his home attendant doesn't prepare in a bottle or a spoon for him. And I'll have one for a second. Hey, you hate your child, you dumb bitch. <laughs> I'm you some space. What, are you got, what, are you, what are you gonna say about that, Master of Chaos? No, you're the master of chaos. You see what you did. You set me up. All right, Gabby, stop Please. typing. Whoever's typing, stop typing. I'll put your thing on mute. Mike. Oh, Mike, damn it. mush, stop typing, you fucking mush. What is if that? You know what I was doing? Speaking of mush, you know what look, I was doing? Look at his world. Wait a minute. Look mush at his world. Professional He's podcast. on We're attacking on. you as Whole a mother now. Typing. And I was feeding my baby a bottle. Had to wait till I could put her back in the swing so that I could attack you back. You're a bad man. I'm sick of your shit. And you're going down. <laughs> I, I, mean, I have nothing to follow that up with, really. I, <laughs> that was great. The reality great. is he's still going to be sitting still getting his applesauce in 15 minutes, and he doesn't give a fuck because it brings him to a to cause me pain. Keith, what do you have to say about that? Well, well and once I stop here and tap dancing on a keyboard... Mush, can you see. fucking take care of that, Mush? Yeah, what is going on? Mush, somebody's fucking... T what, what is it? I, I think it's a digital thing. I don't think it's a keyboard. I, it sounds like somebody's looking at it. Mo it's like somebody it's fucking, fucking typing. That's Gabby. That's Gabby typing. It's Gabby. That's what it is. Hey. Well, hey, little, well, who hey, is little it? tits. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel, I feel so much better that Rachel got to come and confront this bully. In today's society, too much, too much bullying You're, going on. Yeah, well, can I just say something to you, Rachel? Mike Calta, the guy saying that, took his side. I'm sure he did. I'm sure. Uh, what I was saying was I had never what met did, Rachel I before. Know, Mike, what did Keith, what did, what did this old, old man excuse me <coughs> while he was having he, the corners he, of his mouth wiped? I don't, I don't believe I've met Rachel before, and I like her comedy, but Keith led me to believe that she was, A, a jerk, <laughs> Be an alcoholic, be a bad mother, and all those. And I, so I was swayed. Why would Keith lie? But now, now that the truth has come out, I mean, Keith, wait, Keith, this Keith also, he's an entrapper. He, like, if he was in the mob, he would be the first person to sell out and he'll, and he'll fuck your wife. Just make sure whenever Rachel. you stick up for him, he will, if it's Dick, Rachel, her, he would. is that? your boyfriend. Is your boyfriend, your husband typing right now? No, it's a, is it me? Yeah, it's you. Oh, all right. <laughs> well, I don't know why. I've never heard the sound. It stopped. All right. No. 
As a matter of Mike, fact, Mike took Mike Mike took Keith's side. side. I explained to Rachel that I had not met her before, and my trusted friend Keith had me believe that she was an alcoholic and a jerk. And a bad mother. mother. <laughs> yeah. Well, actually, that's my, I guess. <laughs> it's what? What is it? I don't know. I've never had uh, an issue before. Well, Rachel, I just want to say you did great last night. You were awesome. And thanks for not being the jerk people that were trying to make me feel bad about doing good last night. Thank you. Just uh, just on a side note, where's where's the baby? Now hold on, I'll show you the baby. Yeah, there's the baby. He's on a keyboard. She's on a keyboard right now. And why? Uh, according before, to before I give you before I give you your next line, uh, Keith, because her father is holding her. Keith's gonna say that makes me a bad mother. <laughs> Please, because Keith believes that. That you just said you announced that you're you so occasionally stop by your kid's house and that makes you a good good father. But he's like, I never changed a dumb diaper. I don't do that. <laughs> did you not say that, Keith? Is that not an exact quote? Yeah. I'm he did man. say to open the show that women talk too much. Men shouldn't yap. Women should yap. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Keith. So this is what we're Keith doing like, I don't... Oh, now she's crying because she knows Keith is coming towards her. <laughs> <laughs> There's a picture of Keith. Our doorman has a picture of Keith, and, and he knows he's never supposed to let him in the building. Smart. <laughs> how how long ago did you have that baby? How New long ago? Did... unpredictable, and we want her to be safe. Right now, New York is getting a little bad. People people are doing some scary things. People are not people are letting their friends stand on corners and not picking them up and making sure they get to set safely. It's fucked up. Fucked up. Fucked up. Look at how quiet. I've never seen Keith this quiet. Oh, it's just because his internet connection sucks. Don't yeah. think he doesn't yeah. have anything to say. Yeah, right, his internet stinks. Guys. I should All right. Go, this is gonna get well, worse. Rachel, I, 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 I'm so happy you came in and defended yourself. I consider you one of my great friends. I love you, and you're a great mom, and you look fantastic, and you did such a great job last night. Thank you. So did you. I love you, Bobby. I love Bye. you too. Bye. Thumbs down, Keith. Oh, it was her computer. It was her. I bet. I bet it, her husband was on the keyboard, fucking typing and trying to get porn. It wasn't me. All right. Well, relax, there, you fucking little girl. Relax. <laughs> she looks, how old is that baby? You think? A month? Uh, two months? No, it's more than, more than that. But she looks great. Why not zoom? Why not what? What? Keith, what? <laughs> All right, what? we got to let Keith. Keith, it was good having you. You, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I'm scared for Keith he's right now. fine. The master of chaos, he's doing this on purpose. Keith, I'll he's see you. Keith, pill. thank you for coming on. Everybody, uh, Keith Robinson, HBO Max, he fuck. He did murder. He did murder last night. I gotta tell you, he fucking. He went up and smashed him. Um, so uh, there you go. He's gone. Goodbye. Get him out of here, Mush. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god. He's the fucking funniest dude. My god. I mean, would you tolerate? Oh my him? god, he's back. Work. It sucks. What? Can you hear us? <laughs> this is the best. If he starts jerking off, it'll be great. No, you don't want to see his fucking big piece. <laughs> you don't want to see his big dick on the screen. You won't you won't be able to not look at it. Even though you don't want to see a penis, you'd be like, holy hey, god good damn night. it. Good night. <laughs> Bye, Keith. Good night. Well, he really does mean good night. He's got to go take a nap. Go to bed early. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, it, that, I mean, would you tolerate anybody else's computer sounding that shitty if it wasn't that funny? No. No. Oh, my God. No, no, no. We booted, we booted Gabby for less. I've been yeah. booted so many times. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. my great. God. Mush, uh, mush, mush. That was that awesome. It was great. Mush that is the best of chaos. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm the master of chaos. I don't know you're what the, brought Rachel in there. You're I the master of chaos. You guys would love it. Bobby, the guy you're trying to set me up with still hasn't texted me. What do you have to say for yourself? 
you know what? Um, I, I made a call yesterday and the day before, and I, I got blown off. Really? So I would imagine that something is awry. <gasps> Something's afoot. I, what what something happened with the boyfriend? boyfriend? We broke up. Oh, what's up? I'll hit you up after the show. I'm actually having sex with a black belt right now. Oh, there you uh, say a black I'm, guy. I'm, I'm, uh, we're all, your father's glad you added belt at the end of that. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, where'd, the, where'd, the, where, where'd the black belt come from? He was, he is an old flame. Oh, okay. I all right, wait a quick. Bobby, if you had to guess, how many guys has Gabby had sex with? 47. How old are you? 26. 53. I say 47. I can't I can't say, but know that it's in that world. Who be it, like in between our worlds or I don't I've never counted. Yeah, you know, give us an idea. It's in the upper <laughs> it's up. <laughs> How old were you for the first time? 18, 17. Oh, so man, you really moved after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I hit the ground running. Right. Yeah. You almost was, it was it the lighting guy or was it the uh, truck driver? None. No. 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 What? Let me ask you a question. You, you say black belt, but black belt in what? In jujitsu. Ooh. All right. That's no joke. Oh, if you said if you said taekwondo, I'd be like, so. <laughs> <laughs> Karate kid. Hey. Hey. Fucking whatever. Jujitsu, huh? Yeah. Is he, now is he a professional fighter? Yes. No, he, I don't know. Is his last name oh, Gracie? Uh, no. Does he get paid to fight? Not anymore. Oh, oh. But he did. I don't know. Is he I old? Think. How old is he? 30. Oh. Is he Italian? No. Puerto Rican. Is he Jew? No. Jewish? No. Jewish? What Jewish MMA fighter? Really? I don't think he, you, you would know him. He's just Haitian. No. Haitian. <laughs> is he white? No. Ooh. So he's a black black belt. No. What? <laughs> Tiny, you're dating an Asian? No. Brazilian? No. But Puerto Rican? No. Ecuadorian? No. Guatemalan? Close. Oh. What's Cuban? It, Mexican? I don't. I don't really know if I'm going to be honest. He's Hispanic. Really? With your fingers, show us how big his dick is. Oh. Definitely. No, it's not. Something. There's no way. Well, it's I mean, if she would have went like this, we get the point. Listen, there's no way his dick's that big. It's not that big. There's no way. It's not that big. What? But Jesus it's Christ. <laughs> it's a good. It's a. It's good. Yeah, he's Goldilocks. What's that mean? He, yes. Yes. He's like me. He's Goldilocks. He's not too big, not too small, just right. Right. Just middle. right. I, my dick. I had a girl call my my dick Goldilocks dick once. It's that's so good. Yeah. Oh. So. Well. Yeah. Now, so 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 I so cancel the other one then. No, I don't want to cancel the other one. I prefer your option, but this option is fun. Well, I want to know who your who Bobby's friend is. Can't say it. Why? Texas. Don't me. don't say it. Why? I, I want to cut off the episode. Not on air. What'd you say, no, I won't. I, it texted me. I won't say anything. So let me tell you something. If there's a master of chaos, two, it's you. <laughs> no. Okay. I'm. I'm a better friend than I am a master of chaos. On our friendship, if you said here, don't say anything, I wouldn't say anything. Can't say. Are you trying to send me mind bullets? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to oh, send yeah. it to. You. Let's go. Ready? Hmm. Wow. That's who God, it is. Godfrey. Not some... <laughs> <laughs> no, he's very he's the opposite of uh Godfrey. <laughs> Truly. Truly. Dan Natterman. <laughs> <laughs> no. It'd be like Ga if Gabby was a boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's also true. Does he have tattoos? No. No. Hmm. Interesting. That, tattoo is for uh, uh, broken people. People who are broken get tattoos. Okay, I so, have tattoos. So he's not a comic? Yeah, you're broken. 
Yeah. He's not a comic? Uh, no. Not a comic. Do I know him? Woo, that's a clue. Yeah. Yes, you do. But is it going to happen? Here's the real question. Is it going to happen or is this just, are you shipping us in your head? Can you, can you tell me his name and then I'll just, in my head, I'll tell you, and then I'll just tell you if it's happening or not. I'll cut. Can't say what? Can't no. Say no, just tell me. I won't tell. Just text it to me. I love when you, I know you're a little fucking, listen, Calta, let me tell you something I know about you. When you start singing, no, 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 me. No, <laughs> no don't tell me. I'll tell, you know, I know you're up to something. No, I'm I just, it, I like me. I will put it in the chat. Gossip. I need another gossip. I will put it in the chat. You ready? The other day, Bobby and I gossiped on the phone for two hours. So. Good call. That's, like did that. you see? I give you the thumbs up on that. You think? Uh, yeah, looks wise. And all the other boyfriend stuff, yes. Yes. So we'll make it happen. Should Not I just broken. text him? Should I just text yes. him? Yes. Just do it right now. Know. Do it right now. Do it right now. Wait. Just go, hey, you were supposed to text. You were supposed to call me. What's up? Fat JC nailed it. It's What'd you bad, say? The dad from Alf. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Willie. <laughs> what do I say? Just so say, hey, hey, you were supposed to call me. What's it? What happened? Say, would you like to be number 48? But then I know the background story of this all, which is you setting us up. Listen to me. No guy hates when a girl calls and says, what's up? I'm waiting for you to text me. No, nah, dude. It actually ma it, it makes me. Let me tell you something. I always said this to girls. What do you like in a girl? You know what I like in a girl? It's not titties. It's not face. It's not looks. It's not sex. It's I like a girl who digs me. Mm -hmm. That's it. If you dig me and you're not afraid to show me you like me, I'm fuck. I'm into you. I like that. That's the number one thing. I don't care if you get a dead tooth. You got a bunch of fucking weird shit on your forehead. Uh, you're fucking, you're, you're balding. I don't give a shit. I if you that. dig me, you got a shot. Hi, it's Gabby. My vagina's ready. <laughs> ready? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can, I, can, I, can I just say something, Mike? I no. literally just got a call, uh, a thing from my watch guy. Yeah. He said, call me. Good news. <gasps> Call him. You're a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. Hello. <laughs> Call him. I've been known to make things happen. <laughs> you, you, I, I, should I call him? My boobs are the same size, so stretch that wizardry a little bit. I should call him off air, right? Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, but text know, me and let me know. Live, so. That's weird, Mike. That's fucking weird. How weird is that? Like he Literally, meant... I just got a thing in the thing. You just said that. Uh, I think I just shit my pants. <laughs> well, that was my wish. <laughs> <Don't>... <laughs> uh, I'm, not... I'm not kidding. That was funny. Right. We have to read the names before you shit your pants. Yes, Mush, make it make. Alex is fucking perfect. Makes make a bomb a bomb Dana drop for a bad joke. Oh, I think I really pooped my pants. Oh, Why that? On this, are you so close to your house? Oh, it just happens it. like that. That easy? No, I, no, because I I had I had black coffee, two cups, and I smoked a cigar. I shouldn't have done that. What's up? Where um, where we go? Ready? <clears throat> yep. Yes. Hey, I really I can't tell you. Look, we have people come in and out all the time. But you guys who stay in, you guys who just joined up, I want to make sure that we acknowledge you for being part of this thing. For, for There's a lot of options out there. Everybody has a Patreon. There's a million shows. But I truly believe this is one of the funnest fucking shows, one of the funniest shows out there right now. And you know what? For five bucks a month, a cup of coffee, you get 26 shows. Okay. And I want to read this right now to all you people. This is the people I want to thank right now. Jeff Austin, Patrick Lavelle, Zachary Frazier, Kate Aron, Joseph Bruning, Windy City Joe, 
Geoff Lerier. You know what? Christopher Santa Felice. I want to come in like this. Bing, 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 bing. Wow. Yeah. $10. <laughs> 10 claps. Jerry. Jeron Bray. And I want to say something to you. Pick it, lick it, 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 flick it. Thank you. Ten dollars. Oh. In minefield. Oh, suck it. Suck it. Suck it. Oh, Ew. Oh, oh. Oh. Huh. Wait a minute. What the fuck is this one dollar shit? Well, the people who just want to give you money, they don't have access to anything, but they want to. I you. fucking listen. This is for all of you right now for just joining and being part of it. You guys are fucking part of it. Stephen Edwards, Bass. Spencer Carlson, Javier Sanchez, Sean Akins, Bing Murphy, Mark DeSip, Mike Trumbly, Sammy Lametti, Anthony De La Cruz, Paul Vick, Jordan Fudge, Joe Gibbs, Ryan Farrell, Austin, Justin, Joshua Reed, Bryant, Jamie Scandal, Joseph, Derek Gott, Dustin Rezamarin, User Christopher Rodriguez, James Halton, Adrius Gonzalez, Rob fucking Duke, motherfucker, coming out with a new album, dropping shit, making shit. I'll let you guys know about that. He's going to be doing a, a one-on-one in the shed, the live from the shed. Andres Almandas, Steve, John Hilter, Ken Burns, Jonathan McClellan, and Lauren Vizal, Kirk Georgia, Lisa P., David Belenja, Christopher Cruz, Colin Homa, Ryan Nelson, Kyle Costa, uh, Benjamin Squire, John Nonton, Matt Goldstein, Matt Howard Porter. I love you, buddy. Oh, I miss you. Howard Porter, the great comic book artist. Zachary Bell, Matthew Levy, Max Rodos, John Mahu. Fuck, Mike. How many $1 did we give up? Heather. Want <laughs> me to read something? All right, then. Hey. Kristen, yes. yeah, go ahead. Where yeah, where to leave off? Christine right Evans. Evans. Oh, Christine, Christine Evans. Evans. I love Christine, Christine Evans. Evans, Heather Evans. Kuhn, Jacob Callahan, Jaciel Arano, Scooby, <laughs> and Cody Drag. Scooby! Drago, guys, thank you so much for being a part of this. Uh, I can't tell you, it means the world to us. And Luke, all you, deserve, deserve, bugs, Luke, you, have, you deserve to shit your pants because you ate fries with mayo. <laughs> Uh, I can have Lou. I can have mayo. It's on the whole 30. Read it. I can have it. I just overate. I shouldn't overate. But anyways, you guys are now officially ladybugs. Thank you for joining this. Come in, join us on Saturday nights. We let everybody who wants to come in, come in. We have a great uh, party this weekend. I cannot do the um, uh, party. We have to do the show uh, Friday early. Because I have, I will be uh, in a gig at uh, what is it called, Mush? North Carolina. Charlie, good night. Oh, yeah, good night's comedy. <coughs> Sorry. Good, good night's comedy in where? North Carolina. Raleigh, Raleigh North Carolina. Raleigh, Raleigh, North Carolina. I did the gig. Uh, it was fantastic. Uh, before I really do like the place. So uh, make sure if you're in the area, come on out and see the show. Spread the word if you see it. And also, I just canceled. Mush, I'm sorry. I just canceled uh, Stress Factory both shows. No problem. I I'm might. Maybe scared. I'll come out this weekend. Come out, dude. Because right I'm off Monday. Monday. It's a two-hour ride. It's a two-hour flight. I'm there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, maybe I'll fly out Friday and come back come on out. Sunday. Let's do it. I'll tell you the hotel I'm staying at. Um, but, uh, yeah, the Stress Factory gigs in Bridgeport and uh, New Brunswick both canceled. Fucking drama, crazy drama, fucked up shit. I can't, I re I just can't, I can't do drama anymore in my life. I just can't do it. I, I'm, I'm fucking, I'm, I just, if you, if you're a club owner or the club, if you're going to give me bullshit, I'm out. I'm just out. I, I'm good. But I got other dates in Connecticut working right now that are going to be better than that fucking date. 
It's going to be one night only. Of course, Mush, Ron Bennington, and me, where are we going to be? Oh, I'm on that? Awesome. In New Jersey. No, you're not on that, Mush. <laughs> Just fucking plug my date and stop making it about you. I'm not, I'll you tell said, you. <laughs> that you're right. you're going to be live from home plate at Blue Claw Stadium in Lakewood, New Jersey on October 24th. You can get tickets at blueclaws.com. Thank you very much. I am so excited about this gig. It might be... Ron Louie said to me off, this might be the last gig he does. So really? Yeah. yeah. yeah so that's us right there. And then uh Mush, of course, I'll find you another date somewhere and put you on it. Well, um, but I got that date. I might have another date in New Brunswick we're working on. So I might Where? not be there, but I might have a better date uh going up. Uh we'll work we're working on shit. So uh those two dates are canceled. Let Sorry me host. about that. Is your Worcester one still going on? What's that? You're the one in uh, Worcester? 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 <laughs> I just want to know if we should plug it or not for you. That's all. Yes. Plug my dates. My, yeah, my. Saturday, September 19th at the Beer Garden in Worcester, Massachusetts. Worcester, Worcester Massachusetts. Worcester. Yeah, Worcester. Worcester. It's Worcester. It's Worcester. It's Worcester. Worcester. Yeah. We got uh, we got that, and of course we're working on more dates to get me back in the mix, and uh, and there you go. So I apologize for the uh, inconvenience, but uh, the 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 whatever the fucking stress factories are done, done, and probably forever. I'll probably be done with that. I probably won't ever work those clubs again. Wow. Yeah. No. Oh wait this 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 weekend. So the fourth through the sixth. This weekend, it's yes, Raleigh, the eleventh, right? the tenth, eleventh, and twelfth is canceled. Do not, if you bought tickets, return them. Return them. Do not go. You will not be there. Do not go. If you bought tickets, don't go. So, Interesting. um, yeah, I'm looking up flights right now for this weekend. Yeah, so this, I'll oh, do it, man. Fucking come down, dude. Round, I love trip, round trip, four hundred bucks. First the club's, class. Clubs haunted. It's haunted. It's haunted. By who? Haunted. I don't. I don't know. Jacob. What the fuck does that mean? I don't fucking know. Jacob. I didn't meet him, but they have. I'm telling you. I I said the same thing. They showed me video of the back back the area where they you know get the drinks and stuff, and the all of a sudden you see a cup just fly across the room. Cool. Dude, fly across the room. It's surveillance video. And the, what are you shaking your head for? I, no, I don't believe any of the nonsense. I believe that. Next, okay, next show, we're going to have, we're going to do that. This is what we're doing next show. Anybody with ghost stories, anybody with videos, please send them to Mush. Where can they send them? Uh, not what not do really do true. Gmail.com. Mush, say it again. At ykwdude at gmail.com. Oh, I forgot to talk about the fact that I did acid for the first time last week. Oh, yeah. We got to get into that, too. What well, next time. Yep. All right. Next time we'll do that. That's interesting. Fuck. Did now did did uh, Ari Shafir give it to you? No. <laughs> okay. You wouldn't uh, know if you did. I know. <laughs> I know. Anyways. Uh, all right, guys. This has been a great show. Hope you ladybugs loved it. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. What time are we going tomorrow, Mush? Uh, we're going at the regular time of 7 p.m. And then on uh, Friday, we're going to have to go early again because I have shows probably around 3, 3 o'clock. Is that good? Uh, whenever you need. Okay, great. So there we go. And uh, that's it. Gabby, what do you got? Follow me on Instagram at Gabby is Brian. Listen to my podcast, Unabashed Podcast. I might start doing outdoor shows. I have one next weekend, so we'll see if I like it. If not, 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 not that bad. You know what? The outdoor show at the stand, pretty good. Uh, it was fine. It was great, actually. Yeah. And uh, uh, the outdoor shows that I've done have been fucking epic. Yeah. So I have a couple in Brooklyn, and then we'll see how it goes. I mean, I'm I'm fucking a hundred times funnier than you, so it yeah, might be a sure. little different. No, no, we know. No, we know. Thank you. Um, <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, so <laughs> follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. And that's it. All right. Mush, what do you got? Uh, follow me at Mike Mike V. Suarez on Instagram. Uh, follow Bobby at Robert Kelly Live. Follow the show at YKWG Podcast. And yes. make sure you like and subscribe. You listen to this on YouTube. Another great one. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Yeah. Stay the line. 
You know what, dude? We'll see you tomorrow. And you know what, dude? Fucking this show still fucking kicks ass. You've been listening to the YKWD podcast. Thanks for listening. Now go back to your shitty jobs. Shitty jobs.